There's often so much focus on protecting our skin from the sun that you might forget about your eyes. In tonight's Health Watch, Action News anchor Margot Kim shows us the treatment for a common condition that could save your sight. Not much tears Mickey Munoz away from the beach. But after 60 years of surfing, a growth on his eye kept him out of the water and out of the sun. If I just kept holding off until finally it got to the point where it was starting to grow into the colored part of my eye. Pterygiums are the result of too much sun. A yellow or pink growth similar to a callus forms on the white part of the eye. Left untreated, it can spread to the cornea, blocking vision. Have a look here. You'll put your chin right on the rest there. And that fine. fear brought Larie Soto to Dr. John Hovenesian. I mean, it hasn't affected my vision, but it has grown. Feeling okay? Removing them has never been easier. In a 10-minute surgery, the doctor scrapes off Larie's pterygium. To prevent regrowth, he covers the area with graft tissue from human placenta. And so it's thin like parchment paper. Protein glue, instead of stitches, holds the graft in place. It looks better because the eye is less red and inflamed. It is much, much more comfortable for patients because they don't feel stitches on the eye. And it makes the surgery much more qu uh, quick. It cuts the time of surgery almost in half. The regrowth rate drops from 50% to less than 1%, and it's much less painful. It was no different than spending a day in the sun and being a little irritated, and, you know, it wasn't any worse than that. At 70 years old, Mickey still has the moves, but his best move yet may be the hat he now wears to protect his eyes. Margot Kim, ABC 30 Action News.